Today we are designing a girly bedroom wall, soft, modern and full of cozy vibes. It's going to be clean, cute and perfectly balanced. Hey everyone, welcome back to Nice Tower and today I am designing a dreamy pink and white wall for a modern girl's bedroom. If you love interior design and SketchUp modeling, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell because this one going to look really sweet. So first, I hide uh, all the other parts of the room just to focus on the main wall. Now I take a copy of this line at 1000 mm from this side and copy the surface for the other side of the wall. I duplicate it again and paste it right in place. Next, I extrude everything by 400 millimeters. Now, select all and make the component. And use the flip tool to copy it to the opposite side of the wall. Now, I take a 50 millimeters offset. Copy a line 500 millimeters up. Then 150 millimeters. And again 15 millimeters for small details. And the center I draw a vertical line. Then add a soft arch uh, on top. Blend the extra lines. And take another copy of it in this place. I offset this shape 50 millimeters for both sides. And now from the top, I mark 200 millimeters. Draw another arch here and take a 50 millimeters offset. Then I copy the surface to the other side too and keeping it perfectly symmetrical. I push the main area, let the extra lines and push this area inside. Copy the surface out and extrude it by 20 millimeters. Make it a component and move it back in the position. Then I copy this frame multiple times uh, with spacing of 1500 millimeters, typing slash three for equal copies and super quick. Now I push each frame uh, 50 millimeters for depth. Also do it for these parts. For the vertical panels, I use 1001 bit plugin. Enter the value first 10, 15, then 20 millimeters, set angle to zero, front and click. And since clean vertical patterns. And now let's move to the central part. I copy that surface, group it. From the top, I mark 200 millimeters and draw an arch here, offset it by 20 millimeters and extrude the section 400 millimeters out, also for this part. 
extruded again by 50 millimeters and now I clean the extra line with race and control to smooth the surface and for the upper section I use the same 1001 with plugin setup again easy and fast now let's go to materials for the inner panels I use pure white clean and bright color the vertical panels get a soft pink tone and for the center wall I apply a girly wallpaper texture that I downloaded earlier it adds that cute personality for the wardrobes same logic um, paying for the panels white for the rest keeping everything light and sweet now let's unhide the full scene and look at that the design turned out so lovely fresh and perfectly balanced with the overall space this is just the first part of our Gilly bedroom design series. In the next video, we'll model the wall right across from the bed to complete the whole room setup. So if you don't want to miss it, hit like, subscribe and turn on the bell because the next one will make this bedroom come to life even more. See you in the next one.